Spooky season is finally upon us, so today I'll be doing something even more scary than whatever this is and be building Virgin Hu Tao. Is it good? Is it bad? Can a 36 star spiral abyss? Well, on today's episode of Off Meta, that's what we're gonna be answering. Let's start off today's episode by taking a look at the build we'll be using on Virgin Hu Tao. Alright everybody, let's go ahead and start by taking a look at Hu Tao's build. So she is going to be running an R5 Dragon's Bane that has a lot of EM, which is going to be perfect for the Virgin build we are going to be running on her today. And she's also going to be running 4-piece Flower of Paradise Lost, and all of these stats focused on EM. So we got 84 on the Flower, 79 on the Feather, and this is EM, 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 and there's some ER on there as well. So, you know what? We focused on EM for the artifacts, again, we are going for, uh, for Virgin here. Flower of Paradise Lost, also very good for Virgin. And her constellations are going to be, well, none. And for her talents, they are going to be 8, 8, and 7. So her talents, uh, you know, don't really matter here that much, besides really her burst, because her burst can heal her up a little bit, and also does AoE Pyro, so it may be able to help hit a couple of extra, you know, virgins, but besides that, uh, these don't really matter. Again, she, the only thing that really matters for this is the fact that she is level 90, because of course, virgin damage does scale off of your EM, which she does have 1,023 EM, by the way, guys, lots of EM. Along with Hu Tao, we are going to be running Nahida with Sack Frags with Deepwood Memories. She's also going to be C0 with 188 on her talent. Along with Nahida, we're also going to be running Siege Ween. And Siege Ween is like, uh, why, why are you running Siege Ween in this team? Uh, Siege Ween is actually pretty important uh, just for Yaelang. You're also running Yaelang, but we'll get to that later. Because uh, Siege Ween actually helps provide some extra particles for her. But then you're like, why not just run Zingcho? Zingcho also works. Uh, well, the healing is actually pretty important from uh, Siege Ween in this team, I found. Because Hu Tao loves to die, she loves getting her HP drained. So Siege Ween helps sustain us while also adding in a little bit of extra damage. While also adding in a little bit of extra damage with her Ocean Hued Clam set. She's going to be C0, and her talents are going to be 2, 9, and 10. And yes, yeah, that is right, there is a crown in Siege Ween's burst. Uh, go check out the video in the corner if you want to kind of go see why that, that happened. Frankly, the freakiest thing about this video is that we put a crown on a Siege Ween's burst. But you know what, uh, that, that, is, uh, that is for another day, guys. That, that's for another day. And of course, as I mentioned before, we're going to be running Yelon with her signature weapon. She's going to have two-piece tenacity and two-piece emblem. She's going to be C0, and her talents are going to be 4, 9, and 10. Crown on her burst as well. Helps with the extra damage um but yeah that is that is pretty much everything with uh this uh team and build here honestly i'm pretty excited to try it out hotel virgin is you know i don't see this being run very often maybe there's a good reason for that but you know what? we're gonna find out why maybe maybe it's too scary for everybody i don't know i don't know but you know what let's just go ahead and try it out Okay, everybody, let's see if we can blow up this boss with Hu Tao Virgin. Let's hope so, honestly. I don't know if we'll be able to do this. I don't know how strong this team is going to be, but we are about to find out. You know what? That's what we do. Okay, do that with Siege Ween. Then we're going to burst with Yelon and scale with her. Make sure she gets all of her particles. Then we're going to start burgeoning, hopefully. Do we see some Virgin? 36k on that Virgin. Is that what I saw? Okay, that's some kind of crazy Virgin. If, that is, that, if that's what I'm seeing, I don't know if that's what... Yeah, 37k on that Virgin. Did y'all see that? Okay, that was actually kind of nuts. That was a little bit crazy. All right, let's go ahead and get everything set up here again. Very, very nice. Okay, look at the Burgeon. Oh, I love the Burgeon. Yaelon is also helping out a lot with her consistent damage here. And it's dead. Oh, and it's dead just like that. Okay, Burgeon Hotel kind of working pretty well right now. I'm kind of shocked. I'm kind of shocked. Usually, you just want to use Toma for your Virgin, but maybe Hu Tao. It's not as bad as I thought. Okay, we need to test this out more. Let's go fight another boss. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can blow up the Aeon Blight Drake just as well as we blew up the uh, Primo Geovishap here. Well, honestly, I think we can because, you know, it did go pretty well last time, but, you know, what we're about to find out. Okay, let's do some Virgin. 36Ks on those Virgins. Actually, kind of crazy, guys. I love seeing those big numbers. Okay, he's going to start smacking around a little bit. Let's go ahead and burst. With Hu Tao, try to keep her alive a little bit here. Okay, let's go ahead and start our rotation now. Here we go. Do that with Siege Ween again. Get Yelon's burst back up, which is very, very nice. Okay, let's start doing some more Virgin. Yes, okay. You know what's also really nice about this team? Uh, Yelon vaporizes her damage, I think, a little bit. I'm not 100% sure on that. I'm going to have to take a little bit of a look back at the footage there. But that also really, really helps with the damage, which I really like. 
And it's something you don't really see with normal Toma Burgeon teams. I don't think, I'm not entirely sure what you run with normal normal uh, Toma Burgeon teams. I'll have to take a look at that. But guys, Burgeon Hu Tao. I kind of like how it works, and I'm kind of interested to see how this team can perform against Floor 12 with the Spiral Abyss. Maybe I'm going to be running out of there with my hands between my legs. My hands between my legs? No. With my tail between my legs. I don't even have a tail. You know what? We'll figure that out later. Let's go to the Spiral Abyss. Okay, let's see if we can take down this chamber with Burgeon Hotel. Honestly, I'm pretty skeptical if this team can actually do it or not, but you know what? We are here to find out, aren't we, guys? We are here to find out. Okay, let's start by doing some big burgeons against that guy. Some big burgeons against that guy. That guy's dead. Okay, let's try to take this guy out now. Ooh, 38k burgeons? That is some crazy, crazy numbers right there. Let's just do a burst with this. Okay, very, very good first rotation. I loved how that went. Okay, now let's start again with Yelon here. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and burst with her. And now we're going to go ahead and do some more Burgeons. Nice, these guys are grouped together, which I really, really love right now. This is great. Okay, can we knock this guy's Cryo Shield down? Yes, we can. Okay, this is going really, really good right now. Let's go ahead and switch off. That way we can try to get everyone's burst back up here. Let's go ahead and do a burst and a scale with Seedween. There we go. Do a little bit of damage with her. Very, very nice. Okay, we'll try to take this guy down. Now, can we take this guy down? I really want to take this guy down now. Okay, we didn't get the burst animation there, which is kind of funny. I got no more Hydro, though. I got no more Hydro. This is kind of the problem you see with this team. We run out of Yelon's burst a little bit quick sometimes, which can sometimes be... A little bit annoying, but you know what? It happens, guys. It happens. Let's go get some energy up right now for Yelon. Okay, very, very nice. Let's also apply the mark again. Okay, Burgeon time. Can we take this guy down? That is what we want to see. Oh my god, the damage is so much. Oh, we did it though. I didn't even know we did it. Okay, that was good. That was good. Okay, now we just stepped our Lakino finish off this calf, which I'm sure she can. Okay, let's uh let's go let her do that. Okay, I'm swinging up the guys. That was that was a little bit scary. That was a little bit scary, but we're good. We're still good. Okay, uh Arlecchino, time for you to go. All right, let's start off on this next chamber now, guys. Hutao's a little bit low on health, but you know what? That's okay. We're going to use this first half to kind of just get our energy up a little bit, honestly. Let's go ahead and run through these guys. Yeah, Yelon definitely needs a little bit of energy here. So let's go ahead and just do a couple bursts with Seijun. Now it's a Bloom team, guys. Look. Okay, here we go. Let's go with... Oh, <laughs> look at the bur... Okay, that was a little bit crazy. I don't know why that made me so happy, but it really did make me happy. Okay, I love that. Burst with Yelon now a little bit. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and start up this next rotation now, guys. Here we go. Do that with um, Siegeween. Then we're going to go and skill and burst with Yelon. Make sure she catches her particles. Now it's time to burgeon. How much? What type of burgeon can we see here, guys? I'm hoping for some big numbers. Oh my god, where is Siegeween's healing? Siegeween, I need your healing, girl. Siegeween, I need your healing. Okay, we're going to just burst with Hu Tao. Uh, that did not give us that much, uh, you know what, health back. But you know what, that's okay. That's okay, girl. We're going to do a little bit of a burst with Seedrune as well now, too. Very, very nice. Okay, try to get our energy back up here. Very, very good. Okay, we're going to knock around just a little bit. But you know what? That's okay. Can we dodge through that one? Yes, we can. Okay, we're taking down this chicken. We're making some fried chicken right now. Love to see it. Love to see it. Doing some nice big burgeons. Okay, here we go. Let's restart our rotation here now. We may need to wait a little bit to get our energy over. You know what? That's okay. Here we go with Seedrune again. Do a little burst with her. Skill with Yelon. There we go. Okay, let's do another little... Um, Skill with Huta, that's what it's called, right guys? That's what it's called. Can you stop running away from me, Mr. Chicken? I do not appreciate that. Okay, I'm not getting a lot of burgeons off right now. Okay, we're just waiting to get our burst up with everybody. There we go. Yelon, there we go. Okay, okay, we're going to be a little, a little over on this chamber. Okay, we're kind of a little bit slow. We're a little bit slow, but I think we can get this done. Come on, kill it. Kill it, Virgin Huta team. Okay, uh, that was a minute, a minute 20... A minute 15, I think. That's not bad, not good. So definitely a little bit slow against that boss, but it was a Dendro resistant boss. So maybe it is a little bit understandable, but overall, I think the performance was pretty good. Okay, now let's see if our Lakino team can clean up this half. I'm sure they can. Our Lakino's powerful. Let's go and see if she can do it. Okay, we did it. That's it. Okay, Chamber 2's done. Our Lakino carried the second half. Okay, Let's see if they can beat the last chamber no though, guys. I'm a little bit scared, a little bit scared to see if they can do, but you know what? We are going to try to do it. Let's see what we can do here. All right, everybody, chamber three. Let's go ahead and see if we can do this with this team. I am rooting for this team, guys. I am rooting for this team. All right, let's go ahead and start off a little bit slow here again. We don't want to go 
too, too fast. Just want to start it off nice and easy. Okay, let's go with that. And then we're going to burst with Yalon and then hit her with another skill. Then we're going to start the burgeoning. Okay, we're getting some nice damage, it seems. Make sure we hit all of these. We want to activate all of these little eggs here. Can I hit that one? Yes, we can. Okay, very, very good. That is exactly what we want to see. Okay, now we can start getting our energy up here. Hit that with Siege Ween. Make sure we get up all our energy there. Okay, we're not doing too bad so far, guys. Not doing too bad. Let's go ahead and do it a little burst with Seedrine here. I don't know why I said her name so wrong there, but I did. Oh, we spin to win. Oh, I hate when you spin to win, dude. I hate when you spin to win. Okay, here we go. Let's burst like that. Very, very nice. Hit that. Okay, more Burgeon. More Burgeon incoming. Can you please not spin? Oh, he spun to win. Oh, I, I think I can still... I'm like chasing him. I'm like chasing him trying to stop him from spinning to win here. Is that half health though? And we are almost halfway through our time, so we're not doing too bad right now. Okay, let's go ahead and hit that with Seedrine. Make sure we're getting all of our bursts and skills in here. Hit this with Hutat. Did I hit that in time? Yes, I think I did hit that in time. Very, very nice. Okay, let's burst with Seedrine. Get that go. Ha! Can't hit me! You can't hit me! Oh, he hit me. Okay, you know what? I was kind of proud of myself. Kind of proud of Seedrine there. Okay, here we go. Make sure we get our burst up with Yalon. Go like this. Go like this. Oh, my gosh! Another spin to win! This guy's spinning to win like an actual maniac right now. I hate, I hate when he spins to win, guys. I hate it so much. Okay, come on. We're almost try done trying to take this guy down. Oh, okay. That was not bad. The fine explosion at the end killed him. Very, very nice. Okay, now it's all up to Arlecchino. Take this home. I'm rooting for you. I'm rooting for you, girl. Let's do this. And there we go, guys. Finishing the chamber off with Arlecchino with just a few seconds to spare we have just beat the abyss with a virgin hutan team that has seedrine in it it's a little bit cursed just a little bit but you know what guys we did it we're done my goodness my goodness my goodness well guys i gotta say virgin hutan has definitely been an experience honestly it can be a pretty hard team to play, in my opinion, from all of my testing and obviously my Abyss Showcase. What I recommend it to you? Probably not. It does take a lot of premium units like Nahida, Yalon, and Siege Ween to make work. You could replace Siege Ween with uh, Kokomi, but I don't have Kokomi, so I did use Siege Ween. Um, but yeah, all in all, I don't think I recommend this team. But is it fun? Heck yes. And is it spooky? Yes. If you want to see me try out another virgin team, I'd recommend you check out my one on Arlecchino because that one was a lot less successful than Hu Tao. But you know what? Still very interesting in my opinion. Anyway, that is all for me today. And hopefully I will see you in the next video. See ya later.